this is the nail in the coffin that proves just how effective this really is. Coach Greg, and if there wasn't enough research to support NMN and Geo2 Max, well, they're just got that much more. A brand new study, well-designed, double-blind, placebo, you name it, it's done it. Amazing study suggests that NMN increases NAD plus and walking speed. And so what does that mean? A new study suggests that NMN supplementation elevates NAD plus levels and increases walking distance in healthy participants with 600 milligrams a day being the optimal dose. And so what is NMN and what is NAD plus and how does it matter? Well, NAD plus declines with age. And so if you have more NAD plus, you simply don't age as quickly. And so NMN, it's a precursor to NAD plus by supplementing with NMN, you're going to have more NAD plus. And so you're not going to age as fast. And so consider it to be a mild version of the fountain of youth. If you can live longer, prevent the aging process, does that not sound like a supplement you might want to enjoy? And before you get too far, I should note that the FDA has ruled to ban this ingredient from being sold as supplements. And so we have our last run of Geo2 Max, which has been approved by the manufacturer. And after that, we can no longer manufacture it. And so pharmaceutical companies, they recognize just how effective it is. And so they're saying, yeah, you can't sell it anymore. Gee, thanks guys. Finally, something works. You're gonna take it away from us. And in case you're wondering if this is safe, NMN is quite literally found in many foods, just like creatine. And so why do we need to supplement with NMN? Why can't we just get it from food? Well, the problem is most of the foods that have it only contain about one milligram per serving. But with a proper dose of around three to 600 milligrams, perhaps 1200 for serious athletes, one milligram per serving is just not enough. It's simply impossible to get enough from food but it is a natural occurring supplement that occurs in nature. And so the way creatine works is it combines with ADP to form ATP to give you that energy when you're going to the gym. And NMN works as it's a precursor for NAD+. And you need NAD plus in the body to feel youthful, to have energy, to perform cardio. And as we age, that goes down. And so imagine if you can have more. Same thing as if you could have more ATP. And so you supplement with creatine, gives you more ATP. And so you supplement with NMN, you get more NAD+. Makes sense? Of course it does. And so that's why when I take Geo2 Max, I can go harder than last time on the bike, in the gym, have more energy. And is that not what we want? Sure, we want to build muscle, but wouldn't you rather feel better? Wouldn't you rather have more energy? What's more important, big biceps or having a healthy heart? I'd much prefer to have great cardio than to bench press 500 pounds. And so I'm going to summarize the study so that you understand exactly what's going on and you'll understand it works in the real world. The study was based on a randomized, multi-center, as in more than one building, double-blind, placebo-controlled clinical trial. And so the primary end point of the study, like what was the main goal of the study was to see if NMN can actually increase or elevate NAD plus in the blood. And on top of that, they wanted to do a lot of other things, including if it would improve their walking speed, increase mental health and an overall sense of well-being. The researchers recruited healthy men and women between the ages of 40 and 65 with a range of BMI scores. Some were thinner, some were fat, some were somewhere in the middle. So a variety of people, 40 to 65, I'm 47. And so within these people, they were giving three different doses, 300 milligrams, 600 milligrams, 900 milligrams. Remember, they had placebo and so no one knew what was going on. And so let's see, what were the results? What about NAD plus did in fact go up? NAD plus levels were increased significantly in all study groups compared to placebo and baseline. There was also a significant difference between 300 and 600 milligrams a day but not between six and 900 milligrams. And so in case you're wondering, each tablet of GO2 Max, which contains NMN, that's one of the main ingredients, contains 400 milligrams. And so what it's saying is three to 600 milligrams offers great improvements, but that 900, not that much more. And so the great news is if you're looking for anti-aging purposes, you're just looking to generally be healthy, 
one pill a day, most likely enough. You could, of course, take two pills, but you really don't need it if you're just looking for anti-aging properties. But this, to me, this is the nail in the coffin that proves just how effective this really is. Well, I can't say proves, shows just how effective it is. In the six-minute walking test, the improved distance increased by 50%. They give people placebo, they give people pills with Edmund. They do the walking test, and after a month, two months, the placebo group that didn't get MMN, they walked the same speed. There was no improvement whatsoever. But those who took the pill improved by 50%. And so is it simply taking the supplement that made them 50% faster? Or could it be that it gave them more energy and they therefore walked more? I believe a little bit of both. They were not instructed that they had to exercise. There was a double blind placebo group. No one knew what pills they were getting. I'm sure if they said, Coach Greg, train all these people, make them go for walks, train harder than last time. All the people in the control group not taking them in. I'm sure I could have trained them to get faster than last time. But this is the beauty. You take NMN and based on this study, you simply get faster. Why? Well, perhaps you have more energy and you do more cardio, you walk more. Perhaps it's the NMN increasing NAD+. We don't know. Perhaps it's a combination of both. It is possible that participants on NMN began feeling more invigorated early into the study period and increased their physical activity accordingly, which led to better results measured in the clinic. And if that's not enough, I mean, if you're not convinced already, the participants were also asked to complete a 36 question health and quality of life questionnaire. SF36, golden standard to test our people, improving mood, decreasing depression, getting an overall sense of well being. Just generally, how do you feel? How's it going in life? Are you happy? And guess what? Significant increases in those taking NMN than the placebo. And so, what that means is those who are taking NMN, they felt better. I mean, I go so far as to say this is better than eating liver and following the nine ancestral tenets. I mean, after all, isn't that what the liver king preaches? People are hurting at record rates with depression, autoimmune, anxiety, infertility, low ambition in life. And so perhaps liver king needs to start adding GO2 max into his diet to go along with the liver and bone marrow. Was I wrong? Did I lie? Was I exaggerating the truth? When I first started promoting this, I was racing on Zwift. The first day I took it, I improved and set PRs in watts. I was like, what am I on? What is this? My first comparison was this feels like cartering. GW501516, which many bodybuilders, bikini athletes, athletes around the world have been taking and abusing. Problem is, it's banned by water. Take Geotunax, you're not going to fail. Not banned by water. And if you're an athlete looking to get an edge on your opponent, trying to get faster than last time, if you win or lose a race by a second like Coach Greg does in a Zwift bike race, Geotumax. And studies have shown that up to 1,200 milligrams, as in three capsules for the elite athletes, those looking for the maximum performance, three pills a day, you can take that much. And so what do I do? On days I race bikes, like today, I'm going to take three. On days I'm lifting weights, not doing cardio as hard, I take two. Accumulating evidence suggests that as we age, our levels of NAD plus decline increasing our risk of age-related diseases. Now you know why, why I've been bragging about how great GO2 Max really is. One of the problems with NMN is it's not cheap. Hate to break it to you, it's not gonna be as cheap as creatine. To be truly effective in slowing down aging, a supplement not only needs to work, it also needs to be affordable. Currently, the price of NMN is beyond the reach of the average person. Well, if you use code GREG, you get 10% off, and I've bundled packages to save you even more. Bundled packages of 3, 5, 10, and 25. Some people stock it up, getting 100. Don't you want to get this supplement before it's gone? And I get it, you don't want to feel pressure to buy it now, but this is not in my control. The FDA is the one banning NMN. My manufacturer said, this is the last run. You get it now before it's gone. I'm keeping 500 for myself. I don't care. It's Coach Greg. I want to use this. I don't want to run out. This is something I really believe in that I don't want to lose out on. And so you can get one, you can get three, 10, 25, get the amount you need. Although 
perhaps it sells out. Newsletter subscribers, you've already known this. You've already made the purchase. Smart thinking. And so if you believe me, you trust me, make the purchase. If you don't, you don't have to buy it. You can live your life the way you want. You can go out to dinner, to the clubs, buy what you want, buy what makes you happy. For me, health is wealth. Ending it here. Subscribe, click the bell button, comment for the algorithm, like the video if you liked it, watch one of the bloops. Don't forget, I have a freaking cookbook, training book, coaching plans by me and my team. Use code GREG, 10% off. Click the link in the description, code GREG, 10% off. Go right now. Follow me on Instagram, Greg Doucette, IP Pro. And until next time, I am out.